Well, the sun has been shining brightly all day. Good to see that continuing as we get ready for the match here at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal versus Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Alex Lacazette. And the team selected for Brighton and Herb Albion. Well, they're playing the same shape, really. So it's all about getting control of that central area. And which of the wide players has the greatest effect on the game? And so the match is underway. Thomas. Xhaka. An unforced error, you've got to say. Martin Odegaard. Well, moving the ball impressively here. Just made sure nothing came of that. Lacazette. Martinelli. into the clutches of the goalkeeper and in the perfect position to read it Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control Lacazette might be a chance here well just went a bit too early offside Granit Xhaka. Now Lacazette. Martin. Oh, he's through here. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score. But he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. So underway again here, 1-0 the score. Really good attacking play. 
And players waiting in the centre. Pumps clear. Lacazette. It's with Erdogan. There's a slide draw pass. Still could be dangerous. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Partey. Marcinelli. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Oh, could be. A smart stop here. Well, a short corner here. Well, great read there to intercept. Lacazette here. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. So, 2-0 now. How can he take them on and beat them? Crossed accurately towards the far post. Now getting a strong fist on the ball. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal had most of the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Well, it's one pass after another. And options in the centre. And Lacazette. Xhaka. Well, let's see if something comes of this. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And short it is. Marcinelli. And on to Xhaka. Marcinelli. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, there's overall contribution from midfield. Chock full of positives. No getting away from that, Stuart. Well, what a display from him. Lots of touches, some great passes and an assist. He's been absolutely brilliant today. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Thomas Partey. Granit Xhaka. Tierney. Xhaka with it. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Options in the middle. Marcinelli. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Opportunity, Lacazette. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Marcinelli. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. Slipshod passing.
Lacazette. Magnificent defending. Arsenal's free kick here. Well, perhaps he thought he might escape punishment. Not the case. It's a booking. Now that short pass, this could be interesting. Lacazette. Great opportunity. Not a decent attempt, but just pulled wide. Cucurella. Adam Webster. Joel Feldman. Lalana. Enoch Mwepu. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. And they deal with the threat this time. And then with a real chance. And a long way out. Terrific save. Well, that's a top-class save. He read it so well. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Well, they're going for the short one and pull back Albert Sambi Lokonga well cleared away Mopé well they keep working away looking for an opening And a decent delivery. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? Well, 2-1 it is here. So the final whistle fast approaching. It's Arsenal with a narrow lead in this one. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, it's been a decent performance from them. They've certainly played the more expansive football and had the better individuals. Can they now just see this? Oh, what a fine save, and a timely one, Stuart. Well, that does give them some hope, because that would have been the end. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Number 14, Adam Lallana, coming onto the pitch. Number 18, Danny Warbeck. Keen to take it short here. Gabriel. 
Ben White. Thomas now. Lacazette. Clean challenge. Well, not much time left now, and these Arsenal supporters are doing everything they can to get their team over the finish line. What an atmosphere. Oh, Stuart, they could be in here. And the post denied him. No nonsense clearance. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Lacazette. It's with Erdogan. It might be. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. And the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. He's driven in the corner. Able to get a body in the way. And so that is that. The referee blows for full time. A victory for Arsenal. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserved their victory. Alex Lacazette is entitled to be very pleased. What would be your verdict on his performance? Well, he should be happy with his goal and the win, but he'd be slightly annoyed that he hasn't scored a couple more. Overall, though, I thought he was excellent.